Hello, I'm Motorsport71, and I am here to help you install my mod, Left for Liberty Infection, on Grand Theft Auto, Episodes from Liberty City, the Steam version. Uh, obviously, what you're going to need is my mod. Uh, download that. You can get it from GTA4Mods.com. You're also going to need a uh, .NET script hook, version 1.0. 7.1.7 it'll also come with script hook and you're going to need an ASI loader I use X live list um, we'll get to that in a few um, the first thing you're going to need to do is open up your app uh, to get two episodes from Liberty City where you're going to put your mod files you're going to have to go to computer C drive program files you're going to go over here to Steam. Then you're going to go to Steam Apps. You're going to go to Common. Grand Theft Auto 4 Episodes from Liberty City. And then EFLC. Now this is where all the magic is going to happen. This is where all the modding is going to take place. So, what we're going to do is we're going to take everything you need to make the mod work. Now, you're going to have downloaded .NET script hook and it's going to have come with script hook. Uh, so you'll have script hook.net and script hook and what you'll do is you just put them right here into the main file. Now, you're also going to want an ASI loader. Now I use X Liveless. Now, first thing about modding is you make sure you read all readmes. They contain information information is vital. Secondly, the ASI loader I use, xLiveless. xLiveless moves your save files. It also removes online play. Don't say I didn't tell you so. Now, back to that. You'll have your ASI loader, you'll have your script hook in your script hook.net, and what you'll need to do is create a new folder called scripts simple s c r i p t s scripts now you'll take my mod left for liberty open it up open up the scripts folder and copy everything over to it and just delete the readme which you should have read but i'm not going to read you because you can read i hope now, you should be ready to go. Let's launch it and find out. And this is the fun part, waiting for the game to load. And yes, the frame rate's going to be terrible and the graphics going to look terrible. I am using a screen capture software, not actually uh, anything for catching games. So. I apologize, this probably is choppy as hell right now, but this is just to get the point across that the mod is working, I hope. Okay. the hell out of this bar if I can ever remember how to do it. Okay, here we go. F7. Left for Liberty on. F4. Zombies at night activated. Kicked on. 
just to check it, which is the new addition to the mod. Kick them off. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and if you want to double check, hit the tilde, and you'll have yourself a uh, console that should come up. That'll be the definite uh, tell-all. All right, again, Motorsport 71, I hope that helped you install the uh, mod for a Steam app. Have yourselves a wonderful day.